cute. Welcome back to my cringy channel. So I'm not exactly sure how many videos I can fit into this one, but I'm gonna do my best. We are going to be reacting to three make one first, and that thumbnail is pretty cool. So let's start. Uh, last night's oh. game went really good, but a lot of garbage. There was a lot of garbage. And liquids. Is that coffee? Oh, we lost the game last night. We did lose the game, so I remember that. Do still standing. <laughs> I'm actually was nasty. back. <laughs> he had a bony back, that's why I kind of just. Ugh. We had three different schools that day at our high school, and we're all eating lunch together in the gym. Well, okay. Besides we had Caleb sloppy joes. Swallowing his cookie. And he was stuffing all the cookies in his mouth. Uh, Caleb. Over there. Not that that was Jessica that just hopped in front of the camera. And he's still stuffing his freaking cookies. <laughs> I don't understand how like he didn't choke. He just stuffed the whole pit, you high pit, mouth. sat together. Almost. Like how Megan inhales Twinkies. She ate so many Twinkies. What's really cool is that Megan, who's right there behind Caleb, her dad is actually the drum instructor for our school. Well, he doesn't do it anymore. Um, he was the drum line instructor. He's also Alexandra's uncle. Everyone looked at us when he did that, like, pfft. It was not a tradition. That cup thing, Caleb made it up. Oh my gosh, they're both stuffing their faces. That's Cheney High School. What's really cool is that I actually drove by my high school today, my old high school, which was this one, not Cheney, U High, and they were actually playing the drum line outside of the school, which means they actually started band season just a little bit ago. Oh, here we go. What are we doing here? We combined the three schools. There's Evan on the far left on that side, right there. I had to turn on the volume because we were loud. Evan. Yep, Evan's right there. Then we had Cheney, West Valley, and Yuhai all in that one cluster crowd. And the whole pit of each school had to stay in the audience. And the parents are down below. So this guy right here that's conducting, he actually was a leadership guy at Chihuahua Peak Camp when we were there. He was seen in one of my previous videos, if you look closely. I think it was like during the challenge course video, you can see him. I can hear some horns are kind of hesitating, but they're also trying, which is good. And this was when everybody kind of just went in their own sections and started playing the same thing at once. So, so we got three bands combined playing the same thing together. Mm -hmm. Basically. Especially the trumpets right here. Yeah, Josh just enjoying himself right there. Look at your brother enjoying himself. West Valley's in the white Shakos, and Sheenie's in the black Shakos, and the Shakos that just have a straight plume that goes straight up is our school. Very great showcase today, so I hope you all enjoyed this video, and I will see you all in the next one. Bye. That wasn't bad, Pass Gabby. I give you props. Musical school and on the way to Pasco. Oh boy. There's the band room, old uniforms in the back. There's Tanner, Caleb, and Sari. This is Sari. I don't know who drew that. <laughs> he 
did that on purpose. <gasps> There's Jordan! When my hair was long. My hair was braided on that side. This was during bench. I'm not gonna watch the bench performance because that does not need to be seen. Basically, the freshmen, sophomores, juniors, and seniors painted a bench and they had to dance according to that theme. So like, jailbreak or prisoners, I don't know. We were, the seniors were supposed to be dressed like inmates, prison inmates. But if you wanna watch the bench video, feel free to. Okay, now we're on the way to Pasco and Pasco is like two hours away from where we live. And we always took a school bus. We're on the freeway. I can I know where we're at. I can just see it. Yeah, I know where we're at. That bridge, I know exactly where that is. Okay, now we took a rest stop. And Grace, she made so many crochet things. I loved it. This is actually what, um, two of Grace's things that she made for me. Basset hounds. They're basset hounds. Oh, there's the gym that we stayed in. I actually like sleeping on the gym floor. Oh my gosh. We're all sleeping on a gym floor! I, it's, I don't like it, but... I liked it. I was just saying it for the video. So now we are doing part 14, which is Fun Night in Pasco. Let's just see how this one looks. Oh, this was probably later in the day where we were having dinner and I was videoing from the floor while eating and just videoing them singing that song. I don't know what it's called, wait, don't stop believing. Oh my gosh, that was ruined. It hit, the song hit the climax and we were interrupted. This is the next morning. We actually went for show and we were dead tired. There's the color guard in the front and the pit always just like sitting in the back. Cause it's the pit. <laughs> and whenever we went over a bridge, we would try to hold our breath and I always lost. It was too early to be playing holding our breath games. Oh yeah, someone had this gummy bear stuck on the outside of the bus window and all of us were like laughing about it. It was nasty. Look at it. How's it face? So then we did a first run through and it was just a warm up for the judges, I guess. And then we came back to the school, played some games and passed some time. I quit playing the game because someone was cheating and I was like, there's really no point in playing anymore if someone's going to cheat. Oh, Caleb just screamed. A few of the guard girls were with us. If you see anybody that has braids, that's a guard girl. Well, except for Kylie in the background, she wasn't a guard girl. <laughs> and then we got in halves because we had to go in about an hour, maybe. And we were playing a card game, card game called BS. Look how Juliana is sitting. Oh my gosh. The guard girls wear this maroon class B, and the band members wear black class Bs. That's how you can kind of identify who is who. Oh my gosh. <laughs> Check out our show in the description below. Oh, sweet. Okay. That was when we were getting ready. This is after the show. I'll actually react to the video after this. And then, <laughs> this was after dinner. Yep. Oh 
and they were singing Spanish songs. And there were like a couple of guard girls on the bus with us. I spelled where wrong. Oh my gosh. Oh, and he sat on Grace. Oh my gosh. Oh, this was a badass band. They had the Shagos that lit up blue and red, but their footwork was kind of off, but they sounded great. I'm not going to watch the whole thing because I don't need to waste space on my phone. So Central Valley and University, they are the exact same school, only U High is a mirror version of Central Valley, or CV is what we call it, and they, it's a replica. The schools look identical. I love the symbol line. And there's Hannah right here in the red. The only red one on the screen right now. Depressed penguin with a tie. Okay, that was a pretty good um, outro for that one. Okay, so now I'm going to react to the performance that was actually attached to the Fun Night in Pasco. Sorry. Let's see what that looks like. I got some commentary to say. Oh boy. This was our second performance in Pasco. This is how small we were compared to CV. CV was massive. And right after this season ended, the band got a lot smaller. Our band. Turn this up. I'm going to be listening for mistakes, so if you watch my face make weird movements, it's just me listening for mistakes. Because that's just how I am. That tambourine was a little bit late. Wow, that was nice. Nice climax. It was really hard to roll that gong. It's always that one horn. Part two, hi-hat. You can hear my hi-hat. I'm still playing hi-hat. Okay, now I'm playing with the chimes right now, like the wind chimes. You can hear it sparkling. Here comes my slap on the crash symbol. Here comes uh, Caleb with his timpani. Nice. I'm on concert bass drum in Gong. That was good.
Okay, here comes the ballad. The ballad was actually really tricky for me, believe it or not. I was playing hi-hat. So, since this is about the phoenix, like the firebird, we had a uh, saxophone player, I think it was Kylie. She played the phoenix, and I'll point her out right there, behind the guard. And she had this decoration on her sleeves that acted like the wings of the phoenix. And she was playing the death of the bird during the ballad. I was playing the triangle there. That was a nice gong roll. That bass drum is me. So Maddie was on gong, I was on bass drum, and she and I were switching out instruments. Just basically multitasking, which was hard to catch up with sometimes. I played both of those. There's Kylie. She just lied down to represent the death of the phoenix. Movement 4 was my favorite. I rocked out to it. My hair is being weird right now. I'm not playing anything right now. I'll play with it in a second. Here's where it's going to pick up. Here come the visuals for the band. Well, not yet. That symbol roll is me. I missed a part there and then I got upset after that. I was so rough on myself. I missed my crashes and I was actually really hard on myself about that because I just liked playing all of my parts correctly. But that was the Pasco performance um, of 2018 for our school. More to come, I guess. But if you guys made it this far into the video, thank you so much for watching my little memory lane reaction videos because I enjoy doing these. I will see you on the next one. Have a blessed day.